Hello and good evening. I'm Christopher Lesane, the Interim Dean of Student Life, the Athletic Director, and the 10th grade health teacher. And although we started off virtually learning, I am so excited for the school year. Let's go Wolfpack! Hi, welcome to DBCR Back to School. I am your child's Algebra 1 teacher. I have been teaching this material for over 11 years. I have taught in several Catholic schools in the area, and I have a degree in computer science and a degree in biology with a chemistry minor. I also hold a professional advanced teaching certificate for the state, the state of Maryland. I enjoy teaching the subject of algebra because I find it to be useful, and for me, it's a very interesting subject. Growth mindset. Uh, anyone can learn math. There is no such thing as someone being a math person or not being able to progress in math class. If your child makes a good effort and asks questions, they're off to a great start. And I look forward to working with parents and students to support this class. Students will be able to access their assignments for the week every Monday morning. The work must be completed and submitted by Fridays of the same week. They can find these assignments in the assignment tab in Microsoft Teams. Lessons that students do on their own are called asynchronous in this remote setting. They'll be viewing video lessons and taking notes on the material. They will also work out problems and try to apply what is being taught during the video. Homework problems will also be assigned to match the video lessons and all of these notes and problems will be submitted to me as part of the homework assignment. Extra credit is also available each week. When students attend class via Zoom, this is called synchronous lessons. There is a required set of school norms that are in the school handbook, which students are expected to follow during these sessions. Participating in class and completing the engagement and collaborative work is also a very important part of my algebra class. In addition, everybody needs to be respectful of one another. Please feel free to contact me via email. My address can be found in the staff directory on the school website. I hope to meet all of you sometime in person soon. Hello parents, welcome. My name is Brother Bill Hanna. I'm your physical education teacher for all the freshmen here at Don Bosco Cristo Rey. I am one of the Salesians here, along with Father Mike and Father Janelle, and it's a pleasure to be here. I'm assisted in this course with Coach Smith, who is the Assistant Athletic Director. Right now I'm going to give you a brief description of the course and a um, little information about how we would do it if we were in the school building and what we're doing now because of the virtual situation. So let's go on. The description. Students are introduced to a wide variety of sports and activities, okay? They learn basic skills, rules, tactics, etc. Okay, that's for all the sports that we're going to take. The materials needed. When we are back in the school, we will need their physical education uniform, which can be got at Flint O'Hara, which consists of black gym shorts and a Don Bosco Crystal Ray t-shirt. Grades. Everybody's worried about grades. Grades are based on participation. When we're in the building, that includes dressing out and being active in class. I'll explain about the virtual part in a couple of seconds. Grades will be also be based on some quizzes that we would take on the rules and history of the certain sports. I expect all the students to be active in class and to do their best. If they have any medical issues, please let us know, especially when they come in to class, if they're sick or whatever. And the objectives are we want them to have fun, we want them to be exposed to new and different sports, and hopefully that they will pick up something that they can do for their whole lifetime. Now, something about the virtual learning, which is a little different what's going on now. First of all, all the information, notes and quizzes I give them are emailed to them and they are placed in teams. I expect the assignments and the assignments I give them to be emailed back to me at the specific date. Okay. 
One big assignment that they're going to do on a weekly basis since we are not in the classroom is that they have to keep an activity log. And this was explained to them during the first two periods of class. So they have a general idea about it, so you can ask them about it. It's not that big of a deal, but this is an activity course, so we want them to be active. Above all, don't be nervous, don't worry about it. Everything will be fine, we will get through this. If there's any problems, my email is bhanna at dbcr.org. It is on the syllabus and it's on the addendum to the syllabus. That is, this is the virtual addendum and this is the syllabus. All the students have this, okay? So make sure that you ask them. Sorry I cannot meet you in person. I hope everything goes well for everybody. You are in the prayers of the Salesian community and please say a prayer for us. God bless. Greetings, freshman parents. My name is Mrs. Joy McCarthy. I am your child's theology teacher this year. I am so excited to have them in class. Um, it's been a wonderful start to the school year. Um, and, I, and I can't wait to actually see them when they're in the classroom. So um, let me give you a little introduction about myself and then of the class. Um, this is my third year at Don Bosco, Crystal Ray. I am also in the social studies department and I teach in a, a senior elective called World Religions. Your children though get to be in a theology class where first semester we talk about God's revelation. So we'll be talking about scripture and tradition. Um, there are lots of various projects we get to do. I hope some of them have showed you the who I am activity that they did. They were wonderful and beautiful. And, um, and then second semester, we will have a class on Christology, which is just the study of um, who Jesus is, what he's calling us to, why we understand him to be the Christ, etc. cetera. So um, this, is, this is a fun year where they get to discover um, more about Catholic faith and um, what it is, what is it that we believe. Um, and so don't worry if your child is not uh, Catholic or Christian. Um, so many of us are, are starting off um, on the same footing. And I find the information terribly interesting, and I hope your children do too. You will, um, it's important to look on Teams for the weekly bulletin to see what they are doing every week. Under the Teams post um, is where you will find uh, my bulletin and it is a black page. So it stands out a little bit from the other posts. Um, also, you can check Plus Portals. Um, there is, that is where the grades are and it's also where they post a lot of their graded work. So um, you have access to that and you can check it out at any point and, and see where your son or daughter is. Um, please feel free to call me at any point um, or email me. Email's a lot quicker. Um, and it is right here, the J McCarthy at dbcr.org. And um, you can certainly call the school and I can get back to you um, as soon as possible. I look forward to this year. I look forward to eventually meeting all of them in person and hopefully meeting you as well. Peace be with you. Hello, student. My name is Andrea Fuller and I am the technology teacher. I will be teaching about the parts of the computer. Also, students will also learn how to use Microsoft Excel, Microsoft Word, and Microsoft PowerPoint. It is a pleasure teaching your child, and I look forward to meeting you all. Good evening, parents from the class of 2024. My name is Lupita Maria Matadi, and I will be your child's English teacher. This year, we'll be exploring three different novels and one play, as well as working on writing enhancement and vocabulary comprehension. Um, it's really exciting to work with your students, even though we've only spent um, two and a half weeks together virtually. And I look forward to getting to know you all as well. Feel free to email me at any time 
and I'll be sure to keep in contact with you all to let you know how your child is doing as well as any upcoming activities you might want to be a part of. Again, it was a pleasure to meet you and I look forward to getting to know you all post-COVID. Hello everyone, my name is Mr. Miskimmons and I'm your ninth grade U.S. history teacher this year for 2020-2021 at Don Bosco Cristo Rey High School. This is my seventh year working at Don Bosco Cristo Rey. And it is my 20th year teaching in Archdiocese of Washington schools. I was born and raised cradle Catholic, and I grew up in Catholic schools out west, and I firmly believe in Catholic education. I love the children of Cristo Rey, and I hope to retire at the school some decades down the line. But in the meantime, we're going to learn U.S. history this year. So far, we've been learning about the Revolutionary War, and now we're moving into Jefferson's early 1800s America. I think history is really great. I think it's interesting. I know some of the kids think it's a little boring, but it's my job to make it less boring and to make it fun and entertaining. Um, prior to teaching, I was actually a museum curator for a while, working with the artifacts in the back. So I think that's really cool. And I want to like spur that interest in the kids. I'll use anything at my disposal, whether it's an artifact or a photo or an old journal or diary, the textbook, a movie, anything to kind of like make the learning interesting and applicable. So hopefully um, that passion of mine will come across. I've got a bachelor's degree in history, and I've also got a master's degree in Civil War studies. So when in doubt, as you can see from my bookshelves up there, lots of history books. Time permits, I'll read and you know enjoy some history. And hopefully we'll enjoy our time together soon. Hopefully we will be back in front of each other face-to-face -face in the next couple months in the building in Tacoma Park. Until then, happy back-to-school night, and I'll see you guys in class.